Yo, what's up, guys? It's your boy Materialized or Jax Black again with another mother freaking video. And today, guys, I'm gonna be going over all of the stuff that you get from the Super Deluxe Edition of Borderlands 3. Now, if you're unsure of how, what level or tier this uh, game is, this game edition, this is the second highest one you can actually get. The highest being the Collector's Edition. Um, the one I have being the Super Deluxe Edition, the one below that, the Deluxe, and then you have the Standard Edition. Now, the Super Deluxe Edition comes with a multitude of different stuff, as you guys will probably see on screen now. Um, here's a list of all the different items that actually come in this, and um, I'll leave that list on screen for just a couple moments here. If you guys want to pause and take a look at all the different stuff, um, there will just be a list of stuff, not a picture or anything, but I am going to show you guys individually everything you get. Now, loading into the game, first off, you're not going to actually know how to get this stuff. You're kind of going to have to stumble upon it yourself, like I did um, probably when I first loaded this up. Now, the reason I'm saying you're going to have to stumble upon this is because it doesn't tell you where it is. Like, it doesn't tell you how to get to it. It's kind of common sense, but it doesn't tell you how to actually get to it when you first load into the game. But what you guys are actually going to want to do is go ahead and load up your Borderlands 3. And you're going to want to go ahead and hop inside of the game mode here. Hop inside of the playthrough, whatever you guys are doing. I currently am uploading an episode of my first episode of Borderlands 3 up right now. It should be up by the time this video is out, so make sure to go check it out. There might even be a couple episodes out. But um, once you guys are inside of your Borderlands 3 playthrough, you're going to go ahead and pause the game, just as you guys see me do here. And you're going to go ahead and hit social. Now, when you guys hit social, it's going to give you a list of multiple different things. Now, like I said before, um, I have the Super Deluxe Edition, um, and this gives me a lot of different things. Um, this is actually the $100 version, and then the one above mine is the $200 version. The one below mine is the $70 version, and then you have the $60 version, which is the normal one. So, like I was saying before, when you first log in, you're not going to be logged in to your shift. Now, you're actually going to have to log into your shift account if you want to be able to get, check out different stuff. Now, the way I stumbled upon these rewards and actually seeing where I got them is, as you can see here, September 11th, 2019. It's currently the 14th, I believe. No, today is actually the 12th. It's currently the 12th. And it gave me all of these because Borderlands 3 comes out for all consoles tomorrow, and it came out for PC on the 11th. So, well, it came out for PC on the 12th. It comes out for all the other consoles tomorrow on the 13th. So, it is currently about 11 o'clock at night. And I hopped on here and saw that it says September 11, 2019, VIP Welcome Pack. You have redeemed the Vault Insider Program Welcome Pack, which includes a shield mod, a grenade mod, and the official VIP weapon trinket. Look for these items to appear in the player mail and the current level of the first character you load after unlocking this. Now, this isn't actually the stuff it gives you for uh, getting the Super Deluxe Edition. This is just an extra thing that you get for joining the VIP uh, program. The only reason I saw what it gives me is I went over to my mailbox. And when you go to your mailbox, you're gonna notice right away that there is a crazy amount of stuff here. Stuff that I didn't even know was in here and I was like, where's all my stuff for uh, the Super Deluxe Edition? And I hopped in here and I was like, oh, there it all is. Now, basically, what all this stuff is, guys, is, as you can see, I'm going to read through a couple of these. It says, Booster Pack. Owning the Booster Pack has granted you the Deluxe Badass Shield. Press Accept to redeem the mail contents into your inventory. So, I go and press that, and there's no room for this item in your inventory, so I don't have any item, any room currently. But, as you guys can see, there's the Cheddar Shredder, um, the Diamond Butt Bomb, the Toy Box Pack. Um, so, I, I can go ahead and put that in. I can go ahead and accept most of these things. Some of these, they, there's no room in my inventory. But VIP grenade package, I, uh, again, as you guys can see, there's not a lot of room in my inventory right now. But the gold weapon pack, you can go ahead and accept. The gearbox gear pack. The butt stallion pack. Um, the toy box pack. Apparently, you can't accept these. There's no room in my inventory. But um, as you can see, this is the main stuff that you get. Now... I'm going to go ahead and show you exactly some of the stuff that you get in game. I'm going to go in game, show you some of the other stuff, and uh, as you guys can see, this gives you guns and everything. I'm going to go ahead, go clear my inventory out, and then show you some of these in game now. 
Alright guys, so there is um, one more thing that I wanted to go ahead and show you guys as well, and uh, that is the skins that you actually get in the Super Deluxe Edition, and there's I think four or five skins, uh, well, forget it, I'll show you guys right now. So, as you guys can see, the way you guys actually equip this, I'm going to make a separate video on how to equip uh, skins, because it's a really simple thing to do, but not a lot of people actually know how to do it, but I'm going to show everybody how to equip the skins and whatever else, and um that's going to be a separate video, probably like a minute to two minute video, just a real short one to show people how to do it. But the skins that you guys actually have are all in, they're all, uh, all the skins are actually right here. So as you can see, you have the right, you have the normal here, you have the retro blaster, you have the Goldie locks and loads, you have the gearbox prime, and you have the butt dazzle. The, no doubt about it, the butt dazzle is definitely my favorite skin. As you can see, it's absolutely amazing, and you can equip it on absolutely any skin or any gun, like I said, and uh, it looks absolutely gorgeous on every gun you equip it on. Like it, it's insane. Like it actually looks so good. I'll go ahead and show you now. So here is the uh, here's the gun. Here's the butt dazzle on here. It actually looks super super good, and uh, definitely my favorite skin that you get in the Super Deluxe Edition. But yeah, um, I'll probably come out tomorrow with a video on how to equip your skins. It's super simple, but I know a lot of people probably won't watch this video, and uh, they're going to want to figure out how to equip their skins, so that'll be in a video for tomorrow. But uh, that's uh, that's how you guys, uh, that's the other, the other skins that you guys get. So you also get two extra quick change skins as well as uh, your weapon skins. Now, the quick change skins you get... Um, you actually get some you get two different things for your echo your echo 3 you get the screen of death and you get the classic callback so my favorite is definitely the classic callback um, it's like it says retro reverb on it it's really cool this one's nice don't get me wrong it matches the skin that I'm wearing but the classic callback just looks uh, better don't get me wrong both of these look better than the normal one so you know definitely pick one of these but this is definitely my favorite now, not only do you get that, but you get two other skins. Now, I'm actually wearing a head right now that you have to find in game. So, I'll go ahead and take that off. And, um, this is what you guys start out normally. But, you'll get the Horror Punk and the Retro Futurist. Now, the Retro Futurist is what matches your, uh, it matches your device if you have the retro one on and then you have horror horror punk horror punk is my favorite out of these and then i have the marcus bobblehead as well which i don't actually think is a part of the skin pack but it could be possibly um i think it might be i don't know for a fact uh, somebody can comment down below and let me know but uh that's that so not only do you get weapon skins um character skins guns grenades all of that stuff you also get something special for your gun now you get something more than one actually you get weapon trinkets now the way you open this it doesn't actually tell you whatsoever and it's kind of weird that it doesn't tell you because you can literally look all over the game and if you look you won't find anything like there's nothing telling you how to get to them anything at all you actually get weapon trinkets now the way you get these weapon trinkets is different obviously on xbox one playstation and pc for xbox and playstation you're going to hit left on the d-pad for the pc you're going to hit left on the arrow keys now this is going to pop open a page here that um w all you have to do is hover over the weapon you want to go to and whatever weapon you hover over you're going to go ahead and hit either left on the d-pad or left on the arrow keys and this is then going to pop up a box with different trinkets on it. Now, depending on um, if you've joined the Vault Insider VIP program, you'll have a VIP tr trinket for that. But for just the Super Deluxe Edition, you'll get all of these trinkets here. You'll get for Funsies, Neon Skelly, Gearbox Fan, Gold Tier, and Diamond Ponytail. Now, they all look really, really cool. I will go ahead and show you what they look like on some individual guns. So, my favorite to test them on is actually the Girth Blaster Elite. Now, I'm going to go ahead and show you what this one looks like. As you can see, it's nothing huge, but it is a little bit of something special that it adds to your gun. In my opinion, it looks really, really cool, and it's just something you can have 
on your gun to make it uh, a little bit more special. Now, my favorite trinket out of every single one of these, I think, has to be probably Neon Skelly or Gearbox Fan. Just because, um, depending on what you're actually rocking, it kind of changes the way that it looks. So, for instance, as you can see, Gearbox Fan looks pretty cool. Um, it, it's really, really interesting looking. Um, it has a nice little, little vibe to it. I didn't hit a single shot on that guy doesn't shoot very far but it's a nice little interesting look in my opinion um, looks really cool on it uh, let's go ahead and move on to the next trinket the next trinket is called gold tier and this one is right here as you can see depending on which direction you move it faces a different direction you can actually get it to face you sometimes if you move quick enough um, it just really depends on which direction you're moving on this is just a cool little add-on to your gun that makes it just look a little bit more special like I said before now we'll go ahead and move on to the next trinket and we can move on to neon skelly now the reason I said neon skelly is my favorite is because it's the most unique and the most seeing like the most possible one you can see as you can see as I'm standing here I can see neon skelly perfectly and I don't really have to move or try to get it to turn to really see it and it looks great with this skin here now, if you're wondering what skin I'm talking about, the skin it looks best with, in my opinion, is this one right here, which is the Gearbox Fan. It looks really good with this skin. Now, it's um, it has a, the gun has a little bit of hint of green on it, and then the Neon Skelly is pretty much all green and a little bit of black, so it really suits this skin perfectly. Now, the last couple of trinkets, um, I'll show you what it looks like on some different guns. So, you have for funsies here. As you can see, the reason I like doing it on pistols is because not all of them actually work very well so as you can see this gun here um, the trinket is actually put directly in the center and it's actually dangles inside of the gun so you can really hardly ever see it if you were just standing here shooting all you can see is the chain so it's really nothing and it doesn't really do anything for you but if you have it on something like the the uh, hyper hydrator it actually does look pretty good so I can go ahead and show you now if you have it on the hyper hydrator you can see it perfectly right there on the side so it looks really really cool and it's just uh, it's it just looks really nice in my opinion now the last and final uh, trinket that I have to show you guys is the VIP insider uh, the vault insider VIP which you can actually get for free and I believe it's the uh, it didn't actually equip it I think I equipped it on the wrong gun yes I did um, as you can see it's still the wrong gun okay this is actually the biggest and my favorite out of the multiple ones you can get because it says VIP on it and it has a glowing VIP logo it's really really interesting really really cool and it's free all you have to do is go join the VIP insider program and you get it for completely free but uh, yeah that is all the trinkets that you can get okay guys so now I'm gonna go ahead and show you some of the stuff you actually get from the super deluxe edition now the super deluxe edition has a couple different things you actually get as you can see I have a couple legendaries here um, I have two legendary uh, grenades I have two legendary weapons I have a legendary shield and another legendary grenade now the two weapons I have are the hyper hydrator and I also have the girth blaster elite now the girth blaster elite in my opinion kind of looks like a nerf gun as well as this looks like a water gun and that's pretty much I think what it is that's why it's called the hyper hydrator um, it's 20 damage a shock and um, I haven't actually shot any of these because I wanted to go ahead and test them all with you so let's go ahead and look at these now so as you can see this literally shoots water now it's pretty cool in my opinion it shoots water as you can see um, let's go ahead and go test this on a couple of um, skags over here if we can find any if we can find some skags here's a couple here's an adult skag so as you can see it does a uh, it does a decent amount of damage let me turn this down volume down a tad bit uh, on the game sound but as I was saying this does a decent amount of damage now this is pretty good for starting off it is a legendary so it's gonna be a pretty good weapon so um, regardless let's go ahead and take this guy out and let's try out the next weapon so here is the next weapon which looks like a nerf gun in my opinion um, 
I'm pretty sure that's what it's supposed to be. Honestly, it's called the girth. It looks like <laughs> it's called the girth. Yes, um, it's called. It looks like a Nerf gun. So let's go ahead and test some of these out and actually see. Whoa, that's insane. That's insane. Okay, not bad at all. I don't know why I keep reloading. I have 11 bullets in this thing, actually. But yes, this thing is actually pretty good. Um, I mean, does it have a special? No, it doesn't have a special. I keep reloading, but... Pull this out. That's actually really cool. These weapons are actually really, really nice, in my opinion. I really like them. Okay, let's run back a little bit um those are just the two guns that you get guys those are two of the guns that you get that's not mentioning the uh grenades the epic grenades you get here and you also get an epic shield as well as a legendary grenade you get i think four grenades in this pack as you can see you get the rubber cheddar shredder which is a legendary you get the uh ultra ball which is a legendary the diamond butt bomb which is a legendary and the shooting jumping jack contact grenade which is an epic now um these are actually really cool now you also get the amplified razor wire shield which is an epic as well these are all very very cool and um I'm going to go ahead and show you what all of these are now. So the grenade, I haven't looked at hardly any of them. We're going to go ahead and look at the rubber tre rubber cheddar shredder, shredder first. Sorry, I cannot even hear myself talk right now. We're going to go ahead and um, look at the rubber cheddar shredder. That's really hard to say. Rubber shredder ched I cannot say that. Rubber cheddar shredder. There we go. We're going to look at the rubber cheddar shredder first. And um, it's not really a good thing to test it out on these things, but we'll see. Okay, now don't kill it. Hold on, we'll just go back to him. There we go. Oh, he's looking nice, too. Looking cool in that suit, huh? Looking pretty cool. So, let's go ahead and try out this grenade. Whoa. Did he just catch it in his mouth and run away with it? Hold on, did he just catch that grenade in his mouth and run away with it just now? Actually? Are you kidding me? That's a thing? You serious? Oh, I guess he died. I guess he died with it. Hold on. Did was that supposed to happen? I'm confused. Um. Enemies drop a holy metric buttload of cash when damaged. Cool. That's really nice, actually. So they drop a lot of cash when they get damaged. Apparently. That's really cool. That's really really cool. Um. So there's one of the grenades. That's just one of them, though. The other ones are pretty cool as well. So you actually get... Oh, so you get two. You get an XP booster as well. That's really nice. So you get um, you get a shield, and you get an XP booster as well. So this is going to help you rank up very a lot. It's a deluxe badass combustor. Um, so these are very, very cool. These are just the different things that come. Now the diamond butt bomb. Bye-bye, little butt stallion. The queen is hungry. So let's go ahead and replace that with the shooting jumping jack contact grenade. And just throw these just to see what they do. Oh. Whoa. That's actually super cool. Oh. That will do some damage. I guarantee that. So I just want to show you guys what basically these grenades do. So the ultra ball. Let's test out the ultra ball. I don't actually have any grenades. Let me go buy some grenades and I'll be right back guys. Okay guys, I went ahead and bought some grenades here. So let's go ahead and test out this one more, this uh, grenade here. What? 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 That's gonna kill me. Um, <laughs> what? Uh, whoa! <laughs> what? That's... I was not expecting that to do that. That is called the Ultra Ball. Do not taunt Happy Fun Ball. <laughs> so apparently if you throw it it just bounces around like crazy all right nice um have i looked at yeah i've looked at the rubber cheddar shredder i'm pretty sure i've looked at this one no i didn't look at this one because somebody ate it earlier stupid thing all right let's throw this one i did look at that one didn't i no that i guess that's the same one it's just it's not the same one it's just a different variant of the other one so that is pretty cool that's pretty pretty cool and I got another grenade, so I can go ahead and test out this last one just to see and make sure I didn't. Um, 
I guess the diamond, it was the diamond butt bomb. I'm pretty sure I tested this one though. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Oh my lord. Oh my lord. That. <laughs> Yo, that is cool. That's actually so insane. It. I don't think. I don't know if you guys got a good view of that. That was Butt Stallion flying down the field just now. Like flying down the middle of the road. Are you joking? That's pretty insane. I'm not going to lie. That is actually really, really cool. Uh, let's see if I can get a grenade out of this dumpster. So I don't have to walk all the way back up and get another one. No, y'all aren't going to give me a grenade. Come on now. Y'all got to give your man a grenade. Come on. Give your boy a grenade. Alright, let me buy some more grenades really fast. Okay, now I got three grenades. Let's go ahead and I'm going to show you guys this one one more time. <laughs> Are you serious right now? Let's make her flap in the air. Look at her. Look at her. That is so ridiculous. That is ridiculously insane. Oh my god. Okay, I have a scoped gun, I believe. I think. No, I don't have a scoped gun. That's really cool, though. What if I throw it and then go into camera mode? Hold on. I'm going to go into camera mode. I'm going to go into camera mode. Look at Butt Stallion. Look at Butt Stallion. Are you serious right now? It's a grenade that's Butt Stallion. I know what the thumbnail of this video is. I know what the thumbnail of this video is. That is crazy. That is absolutely ridiculous. Are you serious? That's insane. You've got to be joking right now. I like that. That is really, really cool. That's really, really, really cool. That's really nice. This is definitely the thumbnail right here. This is definitely the thumbnail of the video. Okay, well, that's that's pretty much all there is to it, guys. You also get the season pass with this, and... um. In my opinion, it's definitely worth it. You're getting a bang for your buck when it comes to what you're getting for Borderlands. You're getting a crazy amount of stuff. So, uh, for $100, I definitely think it's worth it. Definitely buy this if you haven't got Borderlands yet. And uh, let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. But regardless, it's been your boy Materialized Your Jacks. If you did go to enjoy today's video, make sure to smash the like and hit that subscribe button down below. And do not forget to check out my Borderlands 3 playlist. Uh, my Borderlands 3 walkthrough playlist series whatever you guys want to call it let's play i am going to be playing through the full game and i will probably have maybe one or two episodes up already when this goes out so make sure to check it out guys but regardless it's been able to materialize your jacks and i'll see you guys in the next one peace out guys and imagine a utopia darling i'm just so fed up with these expectations they can weigh me down my heart is begging me to get the hell out of my head i'm gonna live inside the upside down for a minute and pretend